Very much more conservative, I have. All right, all right. Grace, mercy, and peace. Carrie Lake. And was and is to come very soon, I'm certain. This is Alvita King. Alvita King. This is Trump. You may be. Faith and Freedom Coalition. Frank Pavone. Frank, thank you very much. So, um, thank, you. thank you very much. Yeah, this is gonna this is gonna be and probably pretty disgusting. Congratulations as well to watching all these fake Richard phony, Vigory supposed Christians. on receiving the Defender of Freedom Award, a big deal, and to Mike Huckabee, my friend, for a long time, long, long time, getting the Lifetime Achievement Award. I think he's better now than he was 20 years ago. You want to know? This? I heard what he had to say, but. He is not a good example of it. You're in great shape. Thanks, Mike. And thanks for being a friend. I also want to thank a great politician and a fantastic person running for governor of North Carolina. His endorsement yesterday was you guys ever wonder how he amazing. He still looks like he did eight years ago. Right? From North Carolina. I don't know when he's going to start cursing. Lieutenant Governor know, Mark Robinson. Because his language has gotten... That was such an endorsement, it went viral. It was all over the world last night. I think he's going to do office. quite well. These young ladies followed yeah, I mean, me. I guess we like, have, what, 99? This is your 99th <laughs> event. And they're from North Carolina, and they're it'll incredible, be, be and they're beautiful, and they happen to be rich, I think. When they're in front of this audience. But they're great, and he's going to do very well, Mark, I think, in North Carolina. Last but not least, let me say a very special thanks to all of you that are gathered here. The crowd is incredible, and even outside, it's packed. So something's going on. We do have great poll numbers, you know. We just got some poll numbers. 77 to 23. That was good. You're going to win this. That's this, against that the Republicans the and beating Biden by 11. You say, why only 11? How could he possibly do so well? But it's a real mess. Our country's in a horrible situation. Since 2016, okay, Faith and Freedom Coalition volunteers have knocked on $17.8 million, dollars, reached over 30 million Christian voters in their homes. Time. And last year alone, you reached another 30 million voters in their churches. Incredible the job that Ralph and the group do. No group has fought harder in defense of the Judeo-Christian values that we all stand for and uphold, There's and no group no will be more Christian crucial values. to our magnificent victory on Election Day 2024. No. So important. That'll be the most important election we've ever had. I said it with 2016. I'm not going to lie. I said it with I'm going to try to get, put this up on YouTube, so I'm not going to be the to, um, most important election this country has ever had. Go any farther down there. our country no. is going to hell. With your help, we're going to on these, evict just, Crook and Joe Biden okay, from so the White House. Heard. And we're going to take back our country this, and we're going to make going America to great again. <laughs> For seven years, you and I have been fighting side by side to rescue our country from evil and from the sinister forces who hate it. I believe they hate it. And I believe they actually want to destroy it. Now we're approaching the most important battle of our lives. As we gather today, our beloved nation is teetering on the edge of tyranny. I believe that, and you believe that. Our enemies are waging war on faith and freedom, on science and religion, on history and tradition, on law and democracy, on God Almighty himself. They are waging war. That's not a war they're going to win. The radicals are setting fire to our Constitution. Abolishing free speech, attacking religious belief, erasing our borders, corrupting our elections, and we have corrupt elections. This is And trying projection. to impose their blasphemous creed and woke communism on every American man, woman, and child. And that's what they're doing, and they're Tr trying Trump so hard. Trump shut the country down. never now. had a situation Trump like declared a, a right national now. emergency over a make-believe coronavirus. But the people in this room will never... Let them do it. They'll never let them get away with it. So and it's not he's going the one to happen. That's like, this, this we will not waver in defense of our faith, our freedom, for turning this and our great into a American country. flag. They don't want the flag either. They don't want anything. They don't want anything that's Trump good. Trump appointed Miller. You wonder why and how did they ever get elected in the first place? It's sick. Together, we're warriors in a righteous crusade to stop the arsonists, the atheists, globalists, and the Marxists, and that's what they are. And we will restore our republic as one nation under God with liberty and justice for all.
He left that indivisible. The menacing specter of left-wing repression has been growing steadily for years and years. It's been growing, and we were stopping it very powerfully for four years, and now it's picked up at a level that nobody's ever seen before. First, they slandered Americans of faith as haters and bigots. Then they corrupted the media. They installed radical left judges to subvert our Constitution. They used the IRS to target conservatives. They spied on our campaign, and specifically, they spied on my campaign, and we caught them. A terrible, nobody would have thought. Could you imagine if it was the other way? Could you imagine if, let's say, I spied, let's not use Biden, let's use Obama. Let's say, Mike Huckabee, that you and I spied on Obama's campaign. Do you think it would have been fine? You know, this would be, we'd be away for a long time, wouldn't we, huh? They tried to take down a presidency with hoaxes and witch hunts. They're still trying, but we wouldn't let them. And now Joe Biden has weaponized law enforcement to interfere in our they, elections, the greatest they, they abuse of power your, that I've seen and that most yeah. of you have seen in the history of our country. It's a hoax. Every time the radical left Democrats, Marxists, communists, and fascists indict me, I consider it a great badge of courage. During the last 10 months of, during the last 10 months of Trump administration, okay, I'm being indicted for you, and I believe law. the you is more than we 200 million people, people that love our country. They're out there, home, and they love and our they country. To to this is a continuation okay, of the greatest witch hunt of all time, you don't own anything. which has been fully exposed the in the Durham report, the IG report by Inspector General I mean, like, Horowitz. Like most people do. Great yeah, job most people report. work for the government. And by great writers, journalists, and pundits all over the world. And its primary purpose is exactly that, election interference. They want to interfere with the upcoming election. Anybody they want to that, demean, anybody that collects insult, from the government whatever is necessary to interfere. Works for the government. And as you know, the if fake you, if news you work for a hospital, even if it's technically a private hospital, all of the things that you're hospital, reading about and hearing about, you work for the government. You're hearing about things that you can't because believe. Because that's where they get all their money from. Bigger than anything we've ever seen. And if you look at the New York Times, or if you look at the Washington Post, or the okay. mainstream media of any kind, ABC, NBC, CBS, not a word of it. Not a word. Not even a little bit. They want to interfere with the fair and free election to a point where Joe Biden is willing to arrest his opponent, who is leading him in the polls by a very, very large number. They lie, they cheat, and they steal. And this is how low they've fallen in an attempt to win the 2024 election. And we're not going to let that happen. We're not letting it happen. What? You, you let it ha they how rigged the presidential how election of 2020. We are not going to allow to, we are just not going to allow them stop to the rig the, the presidential election of 2024. To not going to happen. Charging a election. former president who did a good job. Yeah, Jesus he had is a coming lot of back. people that were very happy. There are some people Before said it was the, the most consequential presidency. But charging a former president of the United States under the espionage act of 1917. But I'm going like, to humor you guys like making and nuclear say, let's, weapons let's in your there, basement, there, isn't it? going to be an election. An act for a let's crime say, so heinous that only the years. death penalty would let's do say I'm off by a couple is one hundred. of the most outrageous and vicious legal theories ever put forward in an American court of law. It's a disgrace. And the people they have doing it are disgraceful. What makes Just you look at their record. Disgraceful. What, what makes you think the that Trump could Act has stop been used them to go after traitors and spies? It has nothing to do with a former president legally keeping his and own if he documents. Did, if he did get elected, as a president, the law that makes applies you think to that this case is not the espionage to make America act, great. As the lawyers will tell you, and they like to tell you. What, what makes you think he could actually like do the things it, he keeps claiming he'll do? The law will see it, and they already when know. When he couldn't do anything that he but claimed he would do. But the Presidential Records Act, which is not even mentioned in this ridiculous. We didn't 44 build the page, wall. 44 page it wasn't indictment the most of me. Border I didn't know about that. You know, when I graduated Mexico from the Wharton School of Finance, not only we didn't did Mexico study not pay, we did, Mexico getting arrested, more going to jail. Aid from we us. didn't know about that. They never told any us other that. Country except for Israel. Under the Presidential Records he Act, even, which is civil, didn't even stop not that. criminal. And he had a Republican House civil. and Senate in his I had every right to have these documents, personal belongings, and boxes. 
Joe Biden didn't. Even Mike Pence didn't have that right. They weren't covered by the Presidential Records Act. I was because I was president, but they weren't. But these scoundrels and thugs, they only come after me. They didn't go after the many, many other presidents that kept their documents. You know about it. Many, many others. If you look at the Bush family, if you look at uh, even Jimmy Carter, and I'd say he's innocent. I say Jimmy Carter's innocent. But they went after me. They didn't go after anybody else. And they went after me criminally. And it's not a criminal violation. It's not even a violation under the Presidential Records Act. And what could be more accurate a statement than Presidential Records Act? That's what we're talking about. <laughs> not espionage. It's not espionage. I mean, the crucial legal precedent is laid out in the most important case ever on the subject known as the Clinton Sox case. They're not gonna, they, Sox. they are not going to throw him again. Let me give you a hint. It has that something to do with socks and taking okay, things were, out in your they're socks. They're not going to put Trump in After jail leaving the White House, Bill Trump Clinton was kept 79 Hillary. audio tapes in his socks and okay. his sock. Trump, Trump didn't well. lock so he put them in his sock. He locked I didn't. I put mine in boxes outside of the White House and the GSA <laughs> he, picked them up and delivered them. He shut down your churches. Where they were supposed to be delivered. And he, he But they included in the convinced you to Clinton hide in your house. Discussions and the Clinton tapes. A discussion a of U.S. military involvement in Haiti. Unique micro You can't get away from that Haiti, doesn't, Kenny. like, exist. He's done very well with Haiti. The, not only does Discussions exist, of U.S. foreign policy, both defense and offense against Cuba. And what about them allowing causes. China to have military bases now in Cuba? I think uh, you're not too happy about that, Mr. Senator. And he's not even saying anything about it. Recording of President Clinton's conversations with foreign leaders. Sensitive facts about trade negotiations taken from presidential briefings. This is all in the tapes. Discussions with Secretary of State about conflict in Bosnia and much, much more. Not only was Bill Clinton never even considered for criminal prosecution based on the tapes he took. And these are tapes he took. These were serious tapes. But when he was sued for them, he won the case. He won it. Judge Amy Berman Jackson's decision states, under the statutory scheme established by the Presidential Records Act, the decision to segregate personal so materials record from presidential like, records is made by the shit? president during the president's term I mean, and in his sole discretion. Now, this is See, a they do this. They do this. Democrat they appointed judge. So Any status. normal administration, even an opposing so one, will be out would consider that to be the end. That's the end of the case. But this isn't but what not the corrupt but this, Biden this wasn't, regime. This isn't because what they're the, trying to because they know that they're not win the election, to, and it's very hard to win an election when you're probably gonna, definitely. Do, I would we'll say definitely upheld. the worst president in the history of our country, without question. <laughs> the Sox decision. They that. call it the Sox decision. Also, I quote, it says, the National Archives and the Records Administration, ever? or NARA, very radical left group, by the way, they have the Constitution and the Bill of Rights flagged for being dangerous documents. Did you know that? Does not have the authority to designate materials as presidential records. Now, think of that. They don't have the authority. NARA does not have the tapes in question. NARA lacks any right, duty, or means to seize control of those tapes. The president enjoys unconstrained authority to make decisions regarding okay, the disposal so of What Trump should have been in, I Only mean, the president, so they, not so vice these president, leftists, these not ridiculous senators. and stupid leftists. Biden has a lot of documents Go after from Trump his time as a senator. For all this that's trivial bad. nonsense. And he has a lot of documents from Did his time Trump as vice president. That's bad. Trump's 25 uh, that, or so that times the Ukraine documents thing, I have. He has so many documents. That, he doesn't know. They're coming. They, they keep that, him on the floor of his garage where he has that really beautiful called, Corvette, he says. He called another Neither the archivist nor Congress has the authority right. to veto when, the that was president's after decision. Bill, the president can do whatever that's he wants after with Joe Biden it. And this was a big deal, that act. On that TV, passed in Congress. that he extorted that same 19, leader. 77. It said that he wanted the Presidential to, Records to, Act does to not fire a pro, that if confer fire any a mandatory or even discretionary son, authority on the archivist. They have no say give whatsoever give to classify to records. Under the statute, the this responsibility is left solely okay. to the President of the United States. 
So what the hell are we talking so about? They, so they, they, they do all this stuff. They do all this stuff. They do all this stuff. In other words, whatever so documents the president decides to take with him, he has the okay, absolute to get everybody right all riled to take up them. And like he has the them. absolute right to keep them, or okay. he can give what them Trump back to Nara if he what, wants. What he Trump should have been like we were doing, uh, and he can do he that if he should wants. Be That's the law, for, and it couldn't be more clear. What Trump should be Even the New York Times, just to finish up with this hoax, this is the next hoax: Russia, Russia, Russia. We had so many uh, impeachment oaks yeah, number Epstein one, impeachment oaks number two. That's the most. Who the hell else could take this? I stuff? can't even believe I had a nice that life. Now. I had a nice, I easy not life. Anybody's dumb enough to believe. But to believe that Jeffrey Epstein hung himself in jail. But I'm taking it for you because we're going to make our country great again. We're going to put America first. And we're doing it for you. But even the New York Times in a major article, big article, and they must hate. Probably the writer was fired after he said this. But it said headlines. It said that when it comes to asking for documents from former presidents, the only power that NARA has is to say pretty please. Quote, Asking nicely is about all they can do, the, the, and yet they reported me to the, camera, Department the surveillance of Justice camera that was criminal prosecution. In his they don't cell, even have the right to ask. Stop recording. And if they do ask, they have to be very nice, and I don't have to give it. And yet I'm being prosecuted for this. Well, like, did, and this did, is the New did York Epstein Times know the camera saying it. Nothing off? like this has ever happened. Would there be, would there be before, any way you can know whether we'll the camera was on again. or not? And we are working all together. Did, did, did Epstein as a somehow country, disable you know, the camera? I'm probably the only person in history in this country that's been how, indicted. How did he know to my do it at that up. exact moment? Jeffrey Epstein did not hang himself in the jail. It was a kid. I don't know whether I don't know whether Trump. You know, that's probably something that. The, the Bureau of the Living Sky might have known without Trump having to communicate to him directly. Or even to send the order down to him. Like the Attorney General. So that's typically how these mafia organizations are. We've all seen the guys. So fight. true. You see the numbers. You know, we're blowing them all the away. Underbosses. It's crazy. Usually when and that happens, you announce... Them, uh, and then they order somebody else. Ladies and gentlemen, let me leave office immediately. And I want to spend so more time I, I with my don't know, maybe and the family bureau and fight for my innocence. Know. With me, it's just like crazy. What a life I have. I have a crazy life. But Bill Barr should have been impeached too. But you know what? We became president of the United he States and we together he did something that nobody's... When you look at all of the things we did, nobody... Probably nobody has ever done what we did, including rebuilding our military, biggest tax cuts in history, biggest regulatory cuts in history. All of the things that we did... We had no wars. Don't, uh, we got out of wars. We beat ISIS. We defeated ISIS. One hundred percent defeated ISIS. We got out of wars, and you would have never had Russia go into Ukraine. That's what and he You would have been never had for. China. But you, then, but you know what? China talking that like was like he right did that. He, that Taiwan. wasn't just himself. That he and you'd did. never have Jeffrey Epstein ran his any words coming out of North Korea. Kim Jong Un. Like what he said Look, about the United Adam States and the president. No, you don't we think, had a much you don't different think that, time. They respected trial, our country and they respected your president. They really did respect your president. A trial couldn't have Joe like made Trump look bad. He's the most minimum. corrupt president Plus, Trump, in the history Trump of our on, country by far. On the Lolita Express, and he went down to that Just two days ago, a very respected okay, now he IRS get, it's whistleblower. It's not documented as often very much as Remember when the Democrats the used to love was there whistleblowers? They don't like the whistleblowers. That was done not to just... Trump. Revealed that Crooked Joe sat they in a room while his son Hunter messaged a Jeff Chinese FC Communist Party official order him to be killed. and said to this Chinese Party official, "Because I actually suspect, I, quote, I actually suspect that I Jeff am sitting FC here with my father, and we would like to he's understand why the George commitment Floyd made and has not been fulfilled." This is Cash he's talking about. Yeah. I don't think, Tell I don't the director, think, I'm pretty sure and it doesn't Floyd get reported in the breathe. newspapers. And Tell Chauvin the director that I would like to resolve and this now him before it gets out of and, hand. And, and, and now Chauvin means right now. It means tonight. It. You believe this? I didn't know he was that down at, down at Penno Island. <laughs> and if I get a call or a text from anyone involved in this 
other than okay, you, Trump should have been Trump should have been or the chairman. The national I will make certain based that between on the man sitting a next to me, my false narrative. right next to me, pop, hi, pop. And, you, and you every know what, person he knows, about it is I can't you really will regret go into not following that. my direction. Now, can specific, you imagine the newspapers that, not because then they'll take this this? Video. Not a word of it you in any of them. In any of them, mainstream. I'm sitting here waiting for the call, he said, with my father. I'm sitting here with my father waiting for the call. In other words, send us money. Within 10 days, the Bidens got $5.1 million from China. For absolutely no reason. They got $5.1 million. In fact, they've taken tens of millions of dollars from China. And that's probably why maybe he's not complaining about the fact that they're building military bases in Cuba. Maybe that's the reason, I guess. Mike, what do you think? It's not even believable. This stuff isn't even believable. The worst part of the whole story is that the press doesn't want to report it. Because, you know, there was a time like 15 years ago, 10 years ago, you would have gotten a Pulitzer Prize. Of course, they've been totally discredited because they gave Pulitzer Prizes for the accurate and wonderful reporting on Russia, Russia, Russia. Then it turned out to be a hoax. I said, you have to withdraw the prizes. They said, well, we don't know that and we don't want to do that. We've never done that before. I said, that's okay. Do it or I'm suing you. They said, we're not going to do it. And I sued them. You know, we're in court over that. We want them to return the Pulitzer Prize. And by the way, they're being decimated in courts. Very interesting. But we actually brought a lawsuit against them because okay, they gave so Pulitzer Prizes. This country is going down. The New York down. Times and the Washington Post for their it's accurate reporting on Russia, 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 Russia. And even the papers now say it was a hoax. Got, they all say it was a hoax, but they don't want to give back the prizes. So they have to give back those prizes. They will. Joe Biden is a totally compromised president because they're going to be a war with, with Russia. They're paying them off. That's a possibility. They know all the money they've given, and it's real. far greater than anyone who's been able to more. really understand. And I'll tell you what, Jim I, Jordan and Jamie Comer and their, their group has done an unbelievable job, but it's far greater than anybody knows. I don't know whether they're going to This is just Biden. some of the things. It's tens of millions of dollars, and that's just some of it that's been found. And I mean, again, obviously the papers they should. Are reporting, and it's not only China, though. It's Even many though, other countries, including Ukraine. Kamala. So we're giving... Hundreds of billions of dollars to Ukraine. I keep saying, why isn't Europe in order paying for us to get, a like amount? In or, in so we're in for 160 <laughs> billion, Republican to be and Europe is in for 15 before the end of Biden's billion. term. And nobody thinks that's right or fair, and it, it affects them be, more than it affects us. And right us. now, it would be um, these countries McCarthy know every penny on. the Biden crime family for the second has line. taken in. The countries know. Ukraine knows. China knows. They all know. The many is countries. the first in line. So he can't even or ever go against them. He can't go so against them because they'll reveal the corruption. Because they know exactly. They'll say, well, we sent the check here. It, we it, sent the it, check it, there. It, we it, sent. And so he has to be very Pamela nice to China. He has she to can be very nice to Ukraine. And a huge success will be when a vice the New York Times and the Washington Post and, and others put it on their be front page. Now, since what's we really happening here. Because this is truly 100 times bigger than Watergate. This is a much bigger story than Watergate. That's why Biden so doesn't the, the, mind that China Biden, has opened up impeachment these military installations just, just and are in the process of building a tremendous amount in Cuba. It's only 90 miles off our coast. He's basically said it's okay. He's not doing anything. He's not even saying anything. He's not talking about it. What that means for our great Cuban population in Miami, I love the Cuban pop population. We got, we got a record... I got a record number of votes. People were very... I got the Bay of Pigs Award. I was given the Bay of Pigs. It was a great honor. Award by Bay of Cuban Pigs population Award. of Miami. But it means that this group of people in Miami that love Cuba, they want to get back there. They want to see their country. But it means for the rest of their lives, they will never see Cuba again. It's gone. Because China is occupying Cuba right now. That means it's gone. And they were getting ready to make a big, if the election wasn't rigged, the Cuban thing would have been taken care of and people could have gone back and forth to Cuba. Cubans, I'm talking about. They could have seen their family. They wouldn't have the problems that they have right now. He's given everything to Cuba and the dictator and dictators. And you know what that was, but we, it's, it's incredible that this can be allowed to happen. So unless I get back right, in, guys, in which case, like, I will inform China that they have 48 anymore. hours to get any military and spy equipment out of Cuba. This guy is like, I mean, 
Jimmy, hold on to your hat. Or I will drop the hammer, and there will be tariffs unlike anything that China's ever seen before. I mean, if it doesn't happen, if it doesn't happen, if Joe gets elected... I took in hundreds of billions of dollars of taxes and tariffs from China. No other president has taken in 10 cents, not 10 cents. Then there's like... Took in hundreds of billions, gave $28 billion to the farmers because they were mistreated by China. Which is why... Who else does that? Who the hell else would do that? You tell me. They know. We were living in the end times. But Jesus he wants to do nothing back. because he can't. He's really Before bound to not do anything. Because if it does, it's Never forget, like, our enemies want whoever, to stop me whoever, because I'm the only one to finish the job who can the stop century, them. And I'm stopping them be like, because of you. It'll be I didn't need this. this I didn't need it. If these corrupt won't, persecutions it'll be, it'll succeed, on earth. they will complete their takeover of this country States and destroy your way of life forever. And that's where it's going. That's where it's going. It's a disgrace. They want to take... Away my freedom yeah, because I will never before they drop let them the take sheet. away well, your freedom. They want to yeah. silence yeah. me yeah. because yeah. I, will yeah. 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 I will never let them silence you. Uh, and in yeah. the end, they're not after me. They're after you. And I just happen to be so standing all, in their like, way. All like that. That. That's all it is. Very simple, actually. Ultimately, the radical left lunatics are coming after all of us because they know that our allegiance is not to them, our allegiance is to our country and to our Creator. And that's why under Biden, Christians are being persecuted like nothing this nation Trump, has ever Trump seen before. Whenever Trump makes any sort of I don't reference understand to God, how he is not talking people about can vote. People the of creator faith. God. And I'm not just talking about Christians. I'm talking about people of faith can vote for these he's Democrats. He's talking about... They've become he's talking about saying, monsters. They're fighting you Trump all the way the on religion. You know, I watch Biden during and, debates and, when he could speak. And, the, and, and, and he's trying Satan. to say, you know, oh, I love... Being and a then Catholic. The false prophet. You know what they're doing to Catholics? I don't know right? who that is. There's they never been vote. an assault on Catholics the likes I of which think that they're you can make a, a, having right now, what they're having to go through. Make a, a case Biden's that corrupt Elon DOJ Musk. has targeted parents at school board meetings. I don't know for They've sure. They've sent SWAT teams to arrest pro life activists. There's a, couple little, activists. You know there's a couple little things that are missing. The FBI has been caught labeling the vote Catholics totally as domestic terrorists down. and sending undercover spies into Catholic churches. I think there's a possibility that a certain something. Just as it was in the old Soviet Union days. The mark of the beast. Rough stuff. I also think, and I've heard this argued both ways. And how can you. As Christians, how can the people in this room vote for them? It seems to them? me like you know, there has to be something more. Forty percent, fifty percent, sixty percent. There may have of to a be a religious vote. How can they do that? And then they just go about more to trying it. to destroy religion. Okay. If you we look at polls, saw, you'll see religion. Uh, uh, people of faith. If it wasn't, religion was going down in terms of importance. If it wasn't the mark of the beast, it was a type. This is of not a question of importance and popularity. This is a fact. We love God, and we want to protect ourselves. We want to protect the, the cherished position of believing in God. And I think one of the biggest problems this country has right now is that as, as religion does go in the wrong direction, because it's something for you to adhere to and to believe in. It's so good. It keeps you sane. It keeps you honest. It keeps you good. It keeps you kind. It makes you help other people. And they're trying to take that away from you. And I just don't understand, where do they get 30, 40, 50, 60 percent of the vote? It just doesn't make sense. Doesn't make sense. They lie. They lie about their positions. And you have to remember that. In 2024, you have to remember that. Protect your vote is the most important thing. But you have to remember that. And you do have to protect your vote. They want to destroy your religion. Along with They're not the fact like, that they obviously just, want to destroy you, you can do your to country when your you vote. have open borders, when you have no voter okay, ID. Don't, why don't do they vote. not want voter ID? If there ID? is an election, they don't want vote. To <clears throat> Even the Democrats voted 82 percent in favor. Democrats, voting people that vote. Democrats voted 82 okay, percent in favor of voter ID, but the politicians don't want yeah, it. The government is on his shoulders. Cheat. And with voter ID, it's very much harder to cheat. They're mean and they're very, very sick. They are mean and they are very sick. Over the next 16 months, our enemies will try harder than ever to divide us and to destroy us. 
The lies, abuse, and injustice that will come our way will be worse than But if there is, if there is the going to be an country. election... To persevere, then, we must the, stand tall, the, we must say, stand strong. We have, to be strong. Already been decided. we have to be stronger than ever before because they're coming They've at already us. Decided whether There's they're something wrong this, with these people. To give it to and Joe I don't again, like saying that. You know, as president, you're the president Trump. of give it back to everyone. Trump. They've already so decided. I don't like saying that. But there is something wrong with these people, and we have I'm to stand to together. Like or we're not going to have a country anymore. We don't have a country anymore. We already don't have a country. The more they throw at us, like, share, subscribe, click the notification bell. The more united, um, check me out over on Real Diabetic. The more vile the attacks, the more relentlessly. You're watching this on YouTube. This is the digital wilderness. They go after us. We must keep pushing forward. I don't know no whether this will get up on bitches. You just not. keep pushing forward. That's what I do. I get up. People long. say to me, sir, can I ask you a question? But, um, How the hell do you I'll take it? I'll put a link it? in the description. I say, do I have a choice? I don't no, have a I'm choice, out. right? Do I have a choice?